There could be a couple little uh, little, little drops little out drop there. Um, yeah. yeah, you know, a little mist, and that's possible around the area this morning. With they haven't seen anything on radar, at nothing is obviously that heavy, and no reports of anything at the reporting sites. But yes, once again, you may run into a little bit of mist around here this morning with all that humidity. We've got temperatures. This is almost identical to yesterday. We are in the low to mid 70s around here. Stinson is once again the warm spot at 78 degrees and the dew points remain very high. Everybody with a couple of exceptions out there in the hill country. Still, that's a ton of humidity and you've got those dew points of 73, 74 degrees. That's where your glasses will fog up when you walk outside and we do have a moderate amount of mold that did drop down from the previous day's reading. Oak is dropping down too. I think we're finally done with that season. We will stay basically steady this morning cloudy a little bit of mist around here and then it's going to be breezier later on this afternoon wind out of the southeast 10 20 miles per hour gusting at times 25 close to 30 miles per hour 89 for a high temperature another hot one just like yesterday with some sunshine peeking on through and then later on tonight like last night, we're going to be on the lookout for a few showers and thunderstorms off there to the west. And there is the chance for a couple of isolated ones to become severe, say from Rock Springs up toward Junction, maybe close to uh, Lakey, but they'll be very few and far between the majority of those further up to the north. Slightly better chance for rain tomorrow. Then the heat still gets cranked up Friday and especially this weekend. Yep, we're still looking at triple digit temperatures this weekend.